Let's make some preserved lemons. I had an entire bag of lemons that were going soft, so the best thing to do with those is preserve them. To start, we're gonna grab a wide mouth mason jar and add a little bit of salt to the bottom. Then grab your lemons and give them a really good cleaning since you'll be using them with the peels. It's best to use organic lemons because then you know that there's no chemicals in the peel. When preserving lemons, a lot of people keep them whole and then slice cuts into them to add the salt, but I like to have mine into quarters because then it's easier to pull one piece out at a time. So when you're slicing them into quarters, also make sure to take the seeds out that are visible. Now there's two ways you can salt your lemons. You can either add your salt to the bowl and then make sure to cover all sides with a lemon by pressing it into the salt, or, or you can just pour the salt on all sides of your lemon, making sure to cover it generously. You're gonna wanna fill the entire jar up all the way, and when you don't think that there's any room left, you're gonna add probably one more lemon. You're gonna push the lemons down so that way they start releasing the juice into the salt and really pack that jar as tight as possible. I also add whatever remaining salt fell into the bowl into the jar as well. Now we need to juice some of our lemons so that way we can fill the jar up all the way to the top to cover the lemons with juice. I juice one lemon at a time, then pour in the juice just to make sure that I'm not over juicing. Once your lemons are completely covered with lemon juice, we're going to put the lid on the jar tightly. I'm gonna give it a little bit of a shake and then we're gonna put that in the fridge for 10 days. Um, after about 10 days, then your lemon should be ready to use for any kind of recipe. Now we're not gonna waste anything and we're gonna take the lemons that you juiced and cut them into strips. Then just pop them into like a Ziploc bag or any kind of freezer safe container. And when you need them for tea or to add to soups, you can just pull them out of the freezer. They're also a great addition for when you want to do one of those simmer pots for the aroma in your house.